Hello guys, Zumush is here and today I'm gonna show you the secret trick on how to stack more and you just need one item and that's Killing Blade. Yes, all you need is a Killing Blade and you'll be able to stack two or three extra stacks to your already full stacks. Let me show you how. So, uh, give me Oracle because I love Oracle. I mean, you already know. Okay. Killing blade teleport me there please is there cheats oh okay there is cheats oh my god no i didn't want to remove this fuck build the trees again please oh my fucking lord i didn't want to remove okay we're gonna go dire we're gonna go dire then oh my god okay there it is we're not gonna remove the trees here so what I recommend when you stack, put a ward either here or here. This is the dire side. Why you might wonder, it gives me a vision of this, this camp right there, right? So if it's night time, for example, I'll be able to see uh, this camp and I'll just simply E it so I can stack it, right? All right, so what we're gonna be doing here, we're gonna be stacking these two camps without uh getting rid of these trees right and then we will see we'll try to reach the limit right we'll try to reach the crescendo of the staking once we reach that we will cut the trees and then we will see if we can stack more or not can we agree on that let's go so i'll speed up the video because oh, it's gonna take a shit lot of time i will see you when we are there So yeah, I think uh, when you don't remove these trees, the best uh, p uh, the best way to go is down here. I don't think it's better to go like this because these trees again will block. But then when you go here, the stacks will increase and then they will be too much, right? And they will collide onto each other. So then you'll be forced to go up there. So this is what we're going to be doing uh, eventually. But when the stacks are not so big, you can just go down here. I think it's better. That's what I think. Alright, now I'll go up here. I feel like the stacks are too much. Okay. Both of them stacked. And I feel they're gonna reach a limit soon. Both are four. Four by four. I don't think they're gonna stack on the next one. So let's test that. Interesting how Dyer took damage, but the Radiant here didn't take damage. Okay. Is it gonna stack? This one stacked. This one didn't stack. Okay, the Ancient didn't stack. But this one stacked. Okay, let's try again without the trees. Again, we want to reach the limit. This is what we want to reach. This is what I promised. The killing tree is gonna surpass that limit of the stack. And again, this is one of those things that I never see people do. You know, I only post the stuff that I never see people do. You know, you're not gonna see me, for example, posting some stupid stuff, some, you know, cliche stuff. You know, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna post the stuff that I don't see other players, at least in my rank, do. You know? And my rank is not low, I'm almost divine, you know. In fact, I reached divine yesterday and then I got down to ancient 5, so... You know, I'm pretty average MMR. You know, I'm... I'm oh, okay. I, I wouldn't call myself high MMR, but I'm average, you know. But yeah. Alright. Now it's obvious that these two cannot stack. Right, this is stuck at 4, this is stuck at 5. Now let's see what's gonna happen when I clean them trees off. Clean these trees. Clean them. This is not necessary, but hey, let's just clean it. Alright, now we remove the trees. Right now we remove the trees. These two were impossible to, st to stack. Right, these two were impossible to stack to the normal player, right? In my rank, below my rank, even slightly higher my rank. Right, he would say, oh, it's impossible to stack this. If he doesn't know the killing blade trick. 
but you are smarter than that. You know the killing blade. You look at these stacks and you'll be like, no, we cut these trees, we can stack more. Look at this. Just like that. Just like that. Just like that. Easily. Easily stack them both. And we can stack again. Watch and see. Just like that, boys. Another stack. Wait a minute. It did stack. It did stack. Six, seven. Six, seven. See, I told you. Two, three stacks extra to the limit see that's the second stack right now we did there on both of them let's see if we can reach the third one let's see if we can reach a limit to these camps okay i didn't hear a sound oh i didn't hear a sound looks like we reached a limit boys looks like we reached the limit let me try to hit it at 50 like when there is 10 seconds left i hit it always at 52 is it gonna stack nope not even a chance dude yeah i hit it too early feel like i could have if i didn't hit it too early actually okay let's let's try 52 53 let's try this all right let's hit it at 52 uh, 53 psych we hit at 53. Let's hope it's gonna work. Oh, I felt it. I felt it. I felt it at 53. I was like, oh, let's hit it 52. But my guts are telling me 53, you know? <laughs> let's go, let's go. Let's see if we can stack again. Let's hit. This time we're gonna hit 52. 52. 52. I always love to put a word here. It only, it not just protects your stack. It's important to protect your stack, by the way, you know. But it, not, it, it doesn't only protect your stacks, but it also gives you vision. And for me, it kind of calms, calms me a little bit, knowing that I stacked. You know, because the word basically shows me if I stacked or not. It is just something about me. Everyone else is different. I kind of hit it 52-ish, 53. Okay, I stagged this one. Okay. Let's see if we can do it again. So we stagged this by 3, I believe. And we stagged this by 4. Do you imagine the numbers? This was two impossible stacks, two impossible camps to stack anymore. We reached the limit because of the trees. Now we added three stacks here and four stacks here. Can you imagine? That is the power of the... Uh, the creep is going backwards because there is no place, homie. The creep is going back. The creep is going nuts. He's crazy now. He's like, oh shit. A lot of OG here. I need to get out. You know what I'm saying? That's what the creep is saying. This is the power. Got these trees. Okay, let's go. Can we do it again? Can we do it again, boys? That's the question. Oh, we stacked this one again. That's four stacks. Four stacks just because I I cut some trees. I cut some trees. I added four fucking stacks to the impossible camps, right? To the camps that felt like, oh, I can't stack that anymore. I added four extra stacks to that. Do you see how broken that is? Now this is the trick. Now obviously, we have reached the limit. Now what do you do? This is if you want extra stacks, but I don't think you'd want more than that, mate. Come on, this is... What, how much is this? Eight, nine. You don't want more than that, bro. But hey, in case you're crazy like me, you cut these trees. Cut them, cut them, cut them, cut them. Cut. And I think you do it now. Let's see. Let's see. Is it gonna stack? Huh? Oh my god. Wait, what? Oh shit. What? Holy shit. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Alright, I. it doesn't work, apparently. I don't think it's gonna work. I think that's the maximum, guys. We've reached the maximum. 
Anyways, guys, there is the trick. That is eight stacks here, nine stacks here. We added four extra stacks when it looked like it couldn't be stacked more. We added four also here. We added four on each of them. And but, but why are they different though? I'm confused. This is eight, this is nine, oh, whatever. So yeah, guys, uh, there it is. The Killing Blade adds four extra stacks. Just by cutting these trees, you add four stacks to each respective camp in the triangle. I don't know. If you don't think this is broken, I don't know, bro. If you're support, start abusing this trick. Buy a Killing Blade is only going to cost you 100 gold. I was about to say $100. 100 gold. That's all it's going to cost you. You're going to stack four extra stacks. If you have a Dusa, if you have a Luna, if you have a 7, this is wet dream, my guy, for the carry. So yeah, uh, go abuse this trick if you're support. You're going to win a lot of games. You're going to win more games. Uh, by the way, I was Ancient 3 just the day before yesterday. Now I'm, now I'm Ancient 5. I just got Divine 1 yesterday, but unfortunately, Divine Curse went into a losing streak. Today I have a 3-11 score. 3 wins, 11 loses. Very bad, I'm not the happiest today, that's why I decided to make a video, because I don't want to play. <laughs> but yeah, that, that, this is the trick, uh, I hope it helped. Anyways guys, thank you for the support, uh, thank you for the subs, we finally reached 60 subs. Let's aim for 100 subs, can we do it? I'm sure we can. And yeah, thank you for the support, thank you for the views and likes and comments. Uh, thank you for those who are sharing uh, valuable knowledge with the community. It's very much appreciated. And don't forget to watch my other videos, my non-Dota 2 videos. You know, these videos are good too. Uh, I'm currently playing Fears to Fathom. I only did one episode though, but I'm going to do a second episode soon. So if you don't want to miss out, go watch the first episode. Then you will understand what's going to happen in the second episode, right? But yeah, anyways guys, thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.